Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, last week, the question was in our most recent poll on the channel. Do you wait or do you install Windows updates as soon as they are available? And the majority of you said you install Windows updates as soon as they are available. 71% to be exact, according to the poll, and then followed very far behind uh, in second place, only 12% of you said you wait and see if there are problems with the update. And I actually have seen a couple of comments on the channel where viewers have said they actually wait for me to post the update videos uh, to see if there are any issues before installing an update. So 12% of you wait and see if there are problems. Then in third place, 6% of you say that you pause uh, the updates for more than a week so that's two three four five weeks down the line then you only install the update and then five percent of you say you pause the update for one week and the other five percent said it doesn't concern you so you're not really bothered um, about making sure that updates are installed sooner than later so to speak now personally i install every update um, as soon as it's available because obviously um, I've got to get update videos out for the purpose of this channel. So I install any update, be it a quality update, driver update, definition update, other updates. Now I know most of those get, get installed automatically, but if there are optional updates, I make sure they get installed ASAP because obviously I want to get the info out as we like to keep you posted on the channel regarding updates. Now here's my uh, personal advice. Quality updates like the patch tuesday updates so if we just look for the latest patch tuesday update for windows 11 version 22h2 that rolled out on the 9th of august last month that was kb5029263 what i would suggest with uh, the compulsory security updates that are downloaded and installed automatically is I would personally install these as soon as they are available because they contain important security updates and fixes for Windows 10 and Windows 11. But if you are concerned, then I wouldn't pause the update for longer than a week because we are dealing with important security issues that are addressed most of the time. Now, when it comes to the optional updates that roll out near the end of every month, so that would be, as an example, the August update, KB5029351, which rolled out near the end of last month. And I'm just using these two updates as an example. As I always say on the channel, only install the optional updates that roll out near the end of every month, the bug fix updates. If you are experiencing any issues with your OS, else just ignore the update and leave it alone because those updates will be carried over into the next month patch Tuesday update as a compulsory update anyway. And my reason for saying this is that I have found on the channel and in the comments and just running this channel over the last two, three years or so, that most update issues are caused by the optional updates that roll out near the end of every month. Now, obviously there's always an exception to the norm and to the rule, but I found running this channel that most update issues are caused with the bug fix optional updates that roll out. So my advice is, only install optional updates if you have to, else ignore the update. And with the Patch Tuesday update, I wouldn't wait longer than a week before installing them um, because obviously they carry important security fixes to Windows 10 and Windows 11. So that was just to round off that poll. Do you wait or do you install Windows updates as soon as they are available? And as mentioned, 71% of you say you install Windows updates as soon as they are available. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.